Here we are at the Breguet Manufacture in Lorient, in La Vallée de Joux, to speak about the new Breguet Classic 7727. What makes this watch so special is that it is a result of a research started in 2005 and initiated by uh, Mr. Hayek uh, Senior himself. In fact, the idea is to make a mechanism that is as precise as possible with the technologies of today. Uh, it has always been the goal of watchmaking to make the most accurate and precise chronometers. And Breguet choose then to make the same, but using silicon and magnetism. In fact, magnetism has been for a long time an enemy in watchmaking because it could disturb the run of the movement. But thanks to the silicon, which doesn't react to magnets, they could use it here at Breguet into the escapement. The escapement is particularly precise because it is maintained between two magnets. In fact, its axis is like in levitation between two rubies which are backed with the magnets. Only one side of the axis touches one ruby, the other is like floating in the air. This is also possible thanks to a double hairspring in silicon um, that maintain the whole system in equilibrium and this in all position. It will have the same precision, there won't be any effect of gravity on it. It is also a very good system uh, to resist and to compensate the shocks. It's also an ultra rapid escapement, beating at 72,000 beat per minute, meaning 10 hertz, meaning it can measure the 20th of second. This is why this watch is also very precise. And Breguet, in fact, uh, wanted to celebrate the spirit of Abraham Louis Breguet through this piece. And if the movement is very complicated, in fact, the case is really classic. And the dial also. And on the dial, you will see six different patterns of guilloché, which is a signature here at Breguet. The Breguet Classic 7727 is now available in the shops for an average price of 39,000 Swiss francs. We are expecting more innovation in the future because of the impulsion given also by its CEO, Marka Hayek, and the technology that has been developed to really master magnetism and silicon today.